For years, news headlines have been negative about fraternities. Alcohol abuse, hazing, the list goes on and on. But here, at 814 South Main, 55 young men are working hard to change the negative stereotype that the community has put on fraternities. We have been putting on such events such as betas and bow ties to help benefit the community. Uh, Beta Theta Pi is a social fraternity here on campus that's strived on leadership, academics, and especially philanthropy here. Betas and Bowties is a philanthropy uh, dinner. It's a pasta bow tie dinner um, where basically um, we serve uh, the general public uh, pasta dinner, bow tie, pasta. And specifically, like in the name it says, uh, all the betas, all the beta brothers are all dressed up in bow ties, any type of bow tie attire. It could be polka dot, red, black, white, whatever you can think of. Uh, betas and bow ties got started uh, conveniently in class with one of my pledge brothers, Ben Love. Uh, we were sitting in class trying, trying to come up with basically um, some philanthropy ideas. Uh, I was currently the philanthropy chair and we were just kind of coming up with creative ways to try to um, you know, attract people and kind of catchy phrases. And basically, uh, Ben Love uh, was talking about how, you know, our chapter history is, you know, we were wearing bow ties. And so we kind of were playing around with the idea of betas in bow ties um, using bow tie pasta along with us wearing um, traditional style bow ties uh, and kind of making it like a classy uh, pasta dinner event. Welcome to Beta. As soon as you walk in the door, it's like a four-star restaurant atmosphere. You hand your ticket in, uh, the brothers will famously sit you down to any table, no matter how many guests you have. And the great thing about compared to other fraternities and sororities on campus is that we're able to serve you. Good evening, ladies. Uh, we are welcome to the Beta House. We have a couple specials this evening. We have Alfredo pasta, and then we also have marinara pasta. We also have uh, an assortment of desserts. And we also have all of the beta uh, We go through the kitchen, whatever you want, drink, dessert, any type of pasta with Alfredo Marina, we're the ones serving you. We have a great atmosphere with the uh, music going on. And uh, one of the best things that we do is uh, we sing to the people. We like to sing to our guests, sing many Cherish Bears beta songs, and it keeps us going throughout the night too. With Beta Theta Pi's uh, philanthropy, it's a really great benefit that Compared to other fraternities and other sororities on campus, we like to stay uh, based on like community and central base wise. So that way we're benefiting what school we're going to and it really can reach out to the community. Uh, the first year of betas and bow ties was chaotic. Uh, we really didn't know what we were getting ourselves into. We weren't sure um, how many people were actually going to show up and so there was a lot of guessing. Um, we hadn't really perfected the art of cooking mass quantities of pasta. Um, luckily my mom actually came up and was really helpful and was able to um, really help us out um, as far as getting the pasta to not stick when we were cooking in mass quantities and such. We probably only had a hundred people show up uh, the first year so we were only able to raise about five hundred dollars um, for the United Way and, and uh, really go and buy Christmas presents for a family of about six or seven. Um, this past year uh, that just recently happened, we were able to almost raise uh, double that. Uh, our end total was around $800, um, and we were able to actually adopt a family of nine, um, which is awesome and a great improvement, and I think that um, it'll really show uh, us giving back to the community in a positive light and really show and break those stereotypes of typical um, fraternity life. What other philanthropies we hold is, uh, one big one is held in the spring of year, it's called King of the Wing. And specifically, this goes to benefit the SAPA program here on campus, which is Sexual Aggression Peer Advocates. Uh, King of the Wing is a chicken wing eating contest, which is sponsored by B-Dubs. You get teams of five together. It costs $35 per team to get together. And you just basically have, you go off, have a chicken wing eating contest, and we'll crown the winner at the very end of it. It's always a great time. And uh, many other philanthropies we usually hold two main ones throughout the year, but other mini ones that we hold up, we do various road cleanups. We host, we sponsor our own road right now, so we do many road cleanups and any other volunteer activities we can get through the volunteer center. We're highly involved with. As the Greek Revolution continues, organizations are going back to the ideas and values that they were once founded upon. By going to such events such as King of the Wing and Betas and Bow Ties, you can help give back to these mutually these mutual clauses. And with BCA 440 News, I'm Kevin White.